So this is the next question. In this question, the frame view and top view of an object is given to you, and uh, you need to draw the. And you need to draw the asymmetric view of the this object. Okay. So suppose in this diagram, this is a point A. So in the front view, I can show it by A dash. So this point will be nothing but this point. So this is your point A. Okay. So and again, this point. Suppose this point is B. So in the front view, this will be B dash. This point is suppose C, so it will be uh, this point also represent the point C dash. Then this is a point D, so this will be D dash. This is a point E, so this point this point also represent the point E dash. And this point is F, then this point will be F dash. Okay, so uh, this is the way I have marked the, all the points. now i will start the drawing part so whenever there uh, there will be a question like this first uh, what you can do the you can mark the all the points so that it will be easy to draw the asymmetric view okay so first i can what uh, i would draw the i will draw the complete is this square okay this is your 45 mm side this is your 45 mm side so it will be a square first i will do the whole square then what i can do the uh, in the top i can see this is your 25 by 25 by 25 square okay so i will draw this okay so when i draw the square this is your point f so at, when you look at the uh, object from the front this is uh, from the front much means this side so this is your point f so this is will be your point f in the similar way this is your point b then this is your point b then i will draw the small square of 25 by 25 here okay so this point is c means this point here it is c it is point d and this is point e so you can mark all these points okay after uh, marking these points you can see from the top view and the front view that your point b and c okay it is here and it is meeting at the point a here you can see from the uh, top view also your point b and point c is meeting to the point a the similar way you can see the point d and e is meeting to the point a and here your point d and e is meeting at the point a the same way you can see the point f also is meeting to the point a okay so uh, first uh, i will draw the point a okay so your point a is uh, at the distance of 50 mm from the x y line okay the total height of the object is nothing but the 50 mm okay so your point a is here uh, you can see in the front view and from the top view here okay and your point a is on the top so of course there will be a, another point which is below the point a you can see in the top view uh, point a is on the top so there will be one point uh, one point will be there which is at just below the point a so that point is nothing but this point okay and from here you can draw a line of which is of a total length of 50 mm so this length will be 50 mm because total height of a object is 50 mm okay so from this point you can draw a line of 50 mm and you can mark the point a and from the a you can join all the point point b point c point d point f and point e so this is the way you can draw the asymmetric projection of this particular drawing okay and after drawing the uh, asymmetric projection that part which is not be visible to you that part you have to remove it so this portion uh, you cannot see okay so that portion you have to remove 
and of course this this portion was not uh, the part of the drawing 